Finally, to the pitch, Locomotive FC had a four-match unbeaten streak snapped on the road at Pittsburgh on Saturday. El Paso is now in the midst of arguably its toughest stretch of play of the entire season. They play tomorrow night at home versus Sacramento, and then they travel to the West Coast to play Orange County on Saturday. By the time this is over, that'll be 5,286 miles of travel for El Paso, all the way from the East Coast to the West Coast with three games played in seven days. They were back at practice this morning in good spirits, but they're aware of the challenge that awaits them and doing their best to focus on on that challenge that's directly in front of them. First and foremost, playing Sacramento on Wednesday. Yesterday we expected them to be tired, um, and they were. They didn't disappoint us, they were tired, and today we expect them to be bright-eyed and ready to go, and they'll that as well. So training was good, they're, they're up and ready for tomorrow, and you know we're, we're looking forward to another big challenge for us, but one that we know we can, we can take. Kickoff for El Paso and Sacramento at 7 p.m. at Southwest University Park Wednesday. Emmanuel Sanupe, Sebastian Velasquez still expected to be out of this one for a few more weeks with injuries.